Hello Cancer, welcome to your bonus love reading. Let's see what messages will show up for you today. Let's see. Cancer, this is a collective love message for your sign. Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus. So please take what resonates and how it resonates for your overall situation. Let's see Cancer. Show me Cancer. One more please for the situation, one more please for the situation, two, <laughs> okay, at the bottom of the deck we have expectations, those expectations, this card is like a main thing here, for at this time for readings, okay. So Cancer, in this reading we are connecting here for you with someone who is very, very attracted to you and they want to reach out. Attraction, reach out. They found you incredibly, incredibly beautiful, handsome. They are thinking about you a lot. They want to be next to you. They, I feel this is someone who wants to ask you out. They want to reach out in order to be closer to you we on your on your side we have self-focus i feel that you are focusing at the moment on yourself you're making healthy choices you're putting yourself first there is a huge energy of healing i'm also getting that you might be a lot on your plate you know there are other things that you need to kind of pay attention to or take care of but i feel that you are practicing a lot of self self-care self-love Mm -hmm. you are putting yourself first and your well-being which is very very beautiful mutual understanding we have criticism and authentic so um there might have been a situation cancer that um there was a conversation between the two of you and one of the parties criticized another one or just gave some sort of kind of criticism here and um, something to do about being authentic, stop playing games, or some you someone here said that you know um, that they are masking their feelings, that they need to be more authentic about the whole situation. And at the bottom of the deck, we have expectations. So someone, I feel that both of you have certain expectations regarding the situation, and we'll see if they are completely different. overall energy show me this person's feelings show me this person's energy towards cancer and this connection this person that we are connecting in this reading for cancer please please we have a six of wants excuse me i need to pick this card Ow. <laughs> i've hurt myself uh we have hermit you might be dealing with virgo what else we have Please. We have the magician, ten of wands, two of wands, and a six of cups. At the bottom of the deck, we have a ten of pentacles. Okay. You might be dealing indeed with Virgo. I also have Gemini energy. This is someone who wants your attention indeed. 
I feel they put you on a pedestal with the six of wands. But I feel this this is equally someone who can be, you know, full of pride. They might have quite big ego as well. With the hermit, I feel this is someone who would draw their energy or there is there might be an all contact situation at the moment between the two of you. But they are actively trying to manifest you. They are trying to actively manifest you, Cancer. And it starts being uh, too much for them. This is someone who is very overwhelmed with this whole situation and emotions that they have for you. It's like there is this kind of energy of I want to drop this burden. I want to reach out. I want to talk with cancer about this whole situation. I feel that at the moment it might be a case that they are waiting on you. That you know maybe cancer will, will make this first step. And they will come forward and we will have a conversation. If you for instance you know. <laughs> The sign that they're trying to manifest you is maybe you are having dreams about them or there is a suddenly there is a song on the radio and that reminds you of them or you hear this person's uh, a name. Yeah, that's the main kind of sign that, that they're they thinking of you and they're trying to manifest you. But it's getting too much because I don't see you making here that's presumably that's what is happening i'm just looking at their energy but i'm seeing them being very burdened very exhausted and quite overwhelmed with regards to this situation and feelings that they have for you with the two of wands this is someone who is thinking who is planning how to come forward with the six of cups this is, this is an energy of an apology, reaching out, reunion. That's what they want to do. This is exactly that sort of confirmation that we're having. At the bottom of the deck, we have a ten of pentacles. It feels like they want to repair something here. It feels like this person... Uh, wants to um they do want to have stability with you it's like they want to be in a long-term relationship that's their main goal show me cancer's energy towards this person and this connection please show me cancer's energy towards this connection and this person please Cancer's energy towards this connection and this person, please. Mm -hmm. We have a three of swords. We have the ten of swords. We have the four. We have a six of pentacles, a seven of wands. And five of five of pentacles. At the bottom of the deck we have a ten of cups. So they have 10 of pentacles, you have 10 of cups. I feel that there is a love between the two of you. But we are starting your reading with the three of swords and the 10 of swords. That is something here happened. And I feel this. This is very specific. I feel that you've been through a lot. And if you experience heartbreak, emotional upheaval, uh, I feel that in the past you've experienced uh, b emotional betrayal, metaphorically saying there was an instance that felt like someone here stabbed you in the back. 
this is a very very difficult energy that you've been through and with the fall i feel that when you met this person you felt that it's like a breath of fresh air that things will be different that this person will give you more space there will be a sense of adventure you know it's just like a breath of fresh air with the six of uh, pentacles i feel that you've been very generous towards towards this person but equally i'm getting that um there there is something here that you also need to focus on but i feel that you tried to be fair and give this person so much attention here and 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 affection being you know available to them in a sense of or oh, if they want to go out you would go out with them i feel that you were very flexible with regards to this whole situation however something here um it's like this person disappointed you and it made you feel incredibly unhappy i feel and that's expectations is, is showing up here I feel that you had quite high expectations, not unrealistic, but quite high expectation with regards to this person. Um, they felt like a, you know, breath of fresh air, a new beginning. I feel that you tried to be, I feel that you've been trying to be very kind of uh, fair with regards to your time. You've always tried to be supportive and caring. Um, but with the seven of swords it's like there was a little bit too much something here was was getting a little bit too much and at some point i feel that you felt a bit cornered and with the five of pentacles the, the situation really disappointed you that's why you might be coming now from the place that you want to kind of focus on yourself and your matters it's like i feel this person wanted more more and more but i don't see them particularly being um, being as much generous with 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 their time as you were but they were very demanding regards something and I feel that you had your guard up you stood up for yourself and said well hang on a minute uh -uh -uh. and there is something to do with your um with attention that you are getting we have the six of wands i feel that this person was incredibly clingy as well it's just like they wanted your attention 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 only maybe they were too much they were getting too much with this with this communication I feel that there was some sort of uh, conversation and this person didn't take it well with the criticism and they start acting differently they start pushing you away and with the five of pentacles it feels like um, um, at the end you, at, at the end you felt like being left out in the cold with no understanding I feel this person made you feel quite unhappy because they didn't take this criticism lightly it might be because that you even said something about them you know you need to be more authentic because you once you're acting this you why once you're acting that ten of ten of cups here as a, as a mutual sorry not as a mutual energy it might be a mutual energy but overall energy i feel that you do have feelings for this person and this person has feelings for you both of you want the same thing a relationship based on stability and mutual understanding and love but feels like there is a discord they want to make amends with the six of cups apologize whatever the case might be because this is someone who unders they understand you know they are overwhelmed with this situation with the three of three of swords with the ten of swords it might be a case that this person really really um 
disappointed you on a on a huge emotional level huge i'm talking about it's not just you know they they really because this is a card of heartbreak emotional upheaval and ten of swords is like a surrender and i feel that you you saw them at some point as someone oh great you know things might work out i'll be extra attentive here but I feel that you made certain comments or you tried to guide this person and it came from the place of, from a good place, you know, from your heart. But they didn't take it lightly. And it's just like they said something, then you took a, you know, step back. This person pushed you away. You stood up for yourself. You said something as well. And I feel that... The whole situation here doesn't make you happy with the five of pentacles that's why you you might be trying to at the moment focus on yourself in order to heal but the thing is that both of you want relationship oh look eight of wands it's showing up this person will reach out this is a communication back and forward conversation king of cups this person really wants to make amends Show me the outcome. Show me the outcome for cancer. You might be dealing with Aries. I have Aquarius as well. Queen of Pentacles. You might be dealing with Leo. Page of Swords. Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck. Yeah. So they are coming here with some sort of form of an offer. Queen of Pentacles. Mm-hmm. They see you as very caring and very loving. They know that you bring a lot to the table. The thing is that they, that you might be bringing much more than them. And that's how this whole situation really kind of resurfaced. Because this person might be quite insecure. Please take it how it resonates. But they see you as someone who is... This is a pre-empress energy. Someone who... Um, who has so much to offer. We have a strength as a bonding energy so the strength here it's showing that there is a there will be opportunity and there is a chance for both of you to find a common ground but different approach it's needed more gentle approach more understanding and i feel it comes from this and it has to come from this person's side they need to kind of show you here different side of them and um, being more gentle and supportive towards you. We have a page of swords on your side. For some of you at the moment, uh, it might be a case here, uh, Cancer, that from time to time you are checking their social media or you're just thinking about them or quite curious about their next move. But there will be some sort of communication. This communication is coming forward and this person here will be a very calm, and they will try to be very diplomatic about the whole situation. And um, I see them even kind of admitting that maybe, yes, they reacted in a certain thing here, way too reckless or too much. Okay, we have a Five of Swords at the bottom of the deck. I don't feel 100% that you trust this person. With the Three of Swords and the Ten of Swords on your side, you might feel that um, this person is playing mind games. They, they emotionally disappointed you on a massive scale. And, you know, they are playing here mind games. I don't feel they, that you fully 
there is something here that this person has to prove in order to gain your trust because when they will appear and start being completely different or they acting in a completely different way i'm getting that um you might just simply kind of see this as a well that's that it doesn't sound like them are they authentic or are they pretending this is someone who has to prove themselves that that they are real and that they truly want to kind of work on this situation with the six of cups it feels like they do they don't want to kind of um, lose you here because they do feel this attraction they want a stability stable relationship and with the six of cups it's not only attraction it's also this um, this is someone who feels very nostalgic about you um, and there is this kind of energy of soulmate they feel this connection I feel this is someone who loves you but uh, they need to prove that they that you can trust them because looking at your energy you might have a perfectly it's perfectly reasonable for you to to have your reservations that's for sure but expect them to reach out and have this conversation cancer i will leave it here thank you so so very much for being with me please like share and subscribe and once again thank you very much for your time i truly appreciate you Cancer, have a fantastic and wonderful day. And once again, thank you very much for being with me. Love and light. Till next time. Take care. Bye.